What's up everybody, Paul Baker with another episode of Legendary Muscle, and today I have Eric in his 88 Olds Cutlass Supreme Classic. Thanks for coming. Thanks for having me. Now guys, when I first saw this car, this, I'm telling you, this is the cleanest Cutlass I've ever seen, but what intrigued me the most is this is a local car. That's correct. Now how long have you had it? It's been in the family a little over 32 years. 32 years. Yeah. Well, I tell you what, after 32 years in the hot sun of Florida, I'm sure you had your f fair share of weathering on this car. Oh, yeah. This this was uh, passed down to me when I was 16 in high school. And the whole thing was uh, rusted. Even the floor pans were even rusted out. Really? So oh, you yeah. did a ton of work on oh, this car? Oh, yes. Yes, sir. All right. Now, okay, when you're pulling up, I could hear the car, okay? <laughs> and I hear a lot about you already. This car is very loud. And I said, okay, this isn't your typical grandma's car. This thing can't be stock. Oh, no, no. What's under the hood, man? Oh, would you like to take a look? I definitely would. All right. All right, let's take a look. Okay. Holy smokes. That is an amazing engine. Brother, everything underneath the hood looks brand new. Like, hey. everything. I mean, the motor, that thing. Yes. <laughs> everything just looks brand new. Was it all just like those pieces, plug and play, just put them in, you're oh. ready to go? Yeah, nothing about this is really plug and play. I've had to basically modify a whole bunch of things oh from, from the reservoir tank, alternator, even into the block. Now, with the alternator, mm -hmm. it just fit in? I mean, Oh, you... not, that didn't even fit in either. I, I bought that, and this didn't fit. I had the file, the mount. Oh, my goodness. This, you know, this mount here, I had to sit here and drill out this brand new alternator and make everything God, work. Even the motor, man. It, is that, a, is that a brand new engine? I mean, what did you do to the mic? Because everything is chrome. It just looks so great. Oh, yeah. Um, well, it's been through many phases. Uh, I bought the motor in uh, 07 as a crate motor, and then it's been, you know, trial here and there, you know, tried different so things. So it's a 355 rocket. Yes. What was the yes. original motor in it? The original motor was a 307. It was oh, an old man. 307. And that wasn't good enough? Uh, it wasn't, well. <laughs> it, uh, it just didn't have enough power. Well, the uh, spun the crank bearing, and... Uh, couple uh, camshaft gears fell off, you know, so Goodness. I decided after the third time to go ahead and get a bigger motor. So is there anything under the hood you didn't redo? Ah, uh, pretty much everything. <laughs> oh my gosh. Well, I'll tell you what, looking at this bad boy, I have to ask you for a ride. All Show right. me what it's got. All right. All right, guys, we're going to take it for a spin. All right, bro, so that big motor under the hood, let's see what it's got. <laughs> Holy God, bro, that is crazy. Whoa. <laughs> that reminds me of one of the other episodes I did. She totally took me off surprise, but holy cow. I wasn't expecting that. Holy God. All right, man, so let me get over that initial shock. The dash inside, man, all this looks brand new. I mean, did it come like this, or was it... Did you have to get it? Oh, it did not come brand new. This, uh... This actually, I got lucky in the salvage yard and was able to pick this up. The, uh, the old dash that was in it, man, it had about 100 cracks all over oh, it. Oh, man. This uh, looks perfect. I mean, I can't thanks. believe it's in Florida sun and it's, it's yeah. in perfect shape. You keep this drop, uh, garage kept or what? Uh, yeah. A few years ago, I started yeah. keeping the garage, but it was a daily car, you know, back, uh, you know, I was in high school and even out of high school, it was a daily car. My gosh, dude. This is beautiful. So when you got the car from your dad years ago, I mean, do you remember any time being in the car as a kid? Oh, yeah. I, uh, like I say, when I was younger, I used to actually ride in the car seat in the, uh, that is the back cool. of the car here. I used to actually play with little ashtrays to my feet, you know, as a kid. <laughs> so, man, you got a lot of childhood memories in this car. Oh, yeah. So that's oh, probably yeah. why you did so much to it, man. I mean, seriously, it's, it's amazing. Um, this one here is good. This is absolutely awesome, man. Gosh darn. So, all of this had to be redone pretty much. Yeah, I mean, pretty what, much. what about the inside? Like this, the headliner. Much. Yeah, headliner oh, uh, was redone. The back lid. The uh, the carpet actually got out of the Buick Regal. Actually, uh, really? got that out of the salvage yard. So, they're interchangeable, yard. those items. Yeah, all, most of the G-body stuff is. and uh, But the uh, door panels and yeah. uh, basically everything else is still original. Oh, man, this is awesome. What years did they do this particular body style? 
think it's, uh, it's either 81 or 82 to uh, 88, which is oh, wow, 88. they have some years. Yeah, this was the uh, last year, the carryover year. It's the same year they came so out with the... this is the last year of it. Then. Last this year, yeah. Bad. I think it was the carryover because they introduced the uh, front-wheel drive four-door Dude, that's awesome. It's amazing what you've done with this car. Thanks. But, you know, I was talking with Danny. He said you're kind of a mad scientist with anything that you could beef up anything with a gas motor. <laughs> Is that right? What have yeah, you done? Yeah. Um, I mean, anything from my daily driver car, pickup truck. I even did my uh, little scooter, 49cc. <laughs> I, uh, it's a 95cc stroker. Oh, my God. Even a uh, little John Deere tractor. You get tickets in your damn scooter. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Your John Deere tractor too? Yeah, yeah. Even oh the John gosh, Deere tractor, man. yeah. That is great. What did you do to your John Deere tractor? Oh man, that redid everything. I mean, I was able to save the paint, got a chrome stack on it, even got a little underglow on it. Oh my god, <laughs> that's amazing. <laughs> so as you said, is this your only vehicle? Or you have something else right now? Oh, uh, this is one of four. I got one two, of four. Yeah, I got Holy two. Smokes. Yeah, two trucks and two cars. Are they beefed up too? A little bit. My goodness, man. I, that's the one thing I wish I knew how to do. I got to send all my stuff out. It's just beefing up because it, it saves you so much money by doing it all by yourself. Oh, yeah. You know? I mean, definitely. Was it you and a friend that was doing all the work? Um, I mean, mainly me, but throughout the, the time I've had people, you know, help with the interior, like, you know, welding the floor pan. And then, oh, of course, okay. you know, a really good friend helped me with the motor. Oh, and that's... I've learned a lot from that, too. So. Now, what about the pinstriping? Was it like that? I mean, how did you get the pinstriping uh, done? Is that something you did on your own? That was something we thought of. And then when the car was painted, you know, we went ahead and laid the uh, stripes down. I figured it'd give it a little something rather than just being just one looks color. looks awesome, yeah. man. And the hood, obviously, the hood's not original either, right? No, that was actually a lucky Craigslist uh, find uh, for $100 uh, oh many years ago. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. That is awesome, dude. Well, you know what? I appreciate the ride. I've had a fun time with you. This car, I ain't going to lie, it scared the shit out of me. <laughs> but, dude, I appreciate it. But we're running about out of time. So, guys, make sure if you like these episodes, like this, subscribe. And until next time, we'll see you. And today I have Eric and his 88 Olds Cut the Supreme Classic. What the f***? <laughs> Bro. Just say Olds Cutlass. Yeah, yeah, oh, okay, goodness. yeah. Yes, that's too long. All right. Yeah. yeah. It is. Damn it, dude. I better start practicing them in mirrors yeah, or something. Cutlass Supreme. Cutlass like, it's Supreme. like a Taco Bell. Yeah. Right? yeah. Well, can I get the Cutlass Supreme? <laughs> yeah.